Yo guys, what is up? It's me, Robert here, back again with another video for you here today. Today guys, as you saw from the title, today I'm going to be doing a Tuber GT or Jimmy Broadband style of recording for my Radical Race that I genuinely thought was pretty insane. Um, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications and all that great stuff if you want to see more of my awesome videos. Other than that guys, I just want to quickly tell you that I'm sadly not able to find the replay files. Um, they were randomly deleted from my computer during a virus scan um must have been corrupted or something like that i don't know what happened but um super sorry about that guys so i won't be having the replay for that and yeah uh all you have is re race replay and that's the most important part so yeah enjoy boys all right guys here we are at the start of the race we end up getting a very very good start here ending up making a position right in the beginning We're going from fifth up in the fourth already very tight into turn one we're already going three wide right here i end up getting a little bit ahead of them down the straight just with that pace that i got from going on the inside i end up breaking a little bit though because that's even fighting and i don't want to be in the middle of that they crash then going into O rouge and radion we're in single file line here very clean nobody ends up wrecking from what i know down the straight here i end up getting right up on them everyone's really close together except the guy behind me kind of a little bit of gap there and I am getting a very good draft. I ended up going on the inside, passing one, and then get, doing a very late breaking move, doing a Ricardo here, and gaining the other position. Going to second place. Sadly, going into the next two turns, we're, we're gaining a lot of time. We're going pretty quickly, even on cold tires. And then right here, I just end up touching the Astro Trips just a little tiny bit, a little too much, and I end up spinning. I end up giving up the position just to not cause any havoc. Going, Still going too wide into this turn. And then I'm letting him by just to let him know, you know, I'm not trying to be too crazy. The other guy right on my bumper here. We're very close together. We're all very close on pace. Ending up going down through in the downhill section. I'm getting a very good draft and the guy behind me is getting a good draft on me as well. Just a three car train going through here. I end up tricking him going on the inside, getting a very good move. Very close to making contact right there, but I end up getting through. And now we're going down the street very quickly ended up gapping him a little bit much and now in the next few laps here going down through here going very quickly but here on the start we are pretty well we gain the position we go three wide in turn one right there my god that was insane now we're going down the straight as you see i gap i'm starting to get in front of him just a little bit and then i break a little bit much just to not you know cause any incidents or anything like that and now everything's safe everything's cool the arrow view really shows you how close the racing was here everyone was about the same page through here but the guy in front must have jumped the start or something like that he had to have. it's just insane how quickly he went through now going down the street got the the great draft on the orange car and on the blue car we end up doing the late breaking move don't break until the middle of the curves which is just wonderful a lot of late breaking going through here sadly this is right where we made that mistake you can barely see right there higher touch with the actual turf i ended up scaring myself and breaking just giving the position back still going too wide through here though letting a little bit of fighting then in the back there we have a pretty big crash we all could have gotten really messed up there but we ended up being okay and gapping everyone else sadly these trees were in the way too which really sucked but either way there wasn't really anything going on there i just gave him the position going through the next turn now going in the downhill section, you can see we're all still very, very close together. Blue car starting to gap us a little bit, but I end up getting the draft on him through here. We are basically full throttle. I end up tricking him. He goes on the outside. I go on the inside. We get very close together there. You can see we barely touched just then. If not, not at all. It was insane. Now going down the straight, we'll be cool. We'll end up gapping him, and we'll all three be very close within a few laps. Sadly, on the next lap here, right here, you can see we're going down the straight. The, the leader, just insane pace, man. Honestly, just insane. And he ends up spinning into the turn one, just really bad luck. He would have been fine, but I'm sure he had a penalty or something like that for jumping the start, I believe. And he ends up leaving. Here, we'll get an aerial view from his car. Very good down the straight. He has good pace. He honestly just <laughs> an insane driver. Don't know who this is. Uh, and he goes into turn one. You can hear the revs just shift to get da down too quickly and ends up spinning. Now we're getting a uh, roll bar view here. You can just hear the revs going 
crazy high and just boom, the spins. And he doesn't even make contact with the wall, so everyone was confused on why he quit the race, and there he goes. Now, here's me talking about it. Damn, the best stuff, man. Hopefully, you can recover. I was literally about to say the same thing. I feel so bad, dude. This guy was yapping me by a second a lap. Now, here we are going down the last straight. Me and him just fighting a lot for the lead up here. Him in second place. I am going on the outside doing a max for Stappen here. I don't believe I end up hitting this position. We are very close together. I end up going a little bit slower though, since you know the slower line. I end up getting the draft and just trying to do late breaking there. We end up having to kind of pull out, but we're still on the inside doing very well. I try to do a cut, and he ends up spinning. Very bad, very bad driving. <laughs> I'm joking. No, kind of sad that he spun. Very, very, very sad about that because it was very fun racing with that guy. Uh, good luck to him in the next races. But here we are with the guy I was talking about, Sasha Knezvik. He is a great driver, or she, I don't know. I believe they're some so European, so Sasha, man's name, over there. Um, very great driving for the whole time. He was just crazy with pace, and, and going down the straight, we just were fighting quite a bit through Eau Rouge and stuff, going single file right next to each other. You can see the guy in the background. He ended up getting around quickly and not really losing much on us. He ended up getting some time. Going through here, Sasha just crazy through the s's just no regard whatsoever he is a very aggressive driver he has the pace but he is not good when it comes to etiquette safety or knowing when to pull out of it that is the scary part end up learning in a few laps time we were just fighting a lot through here right. now here we go the fight really gets spicy going down the long straight here ended up we were both side by side the entire time i kind of let off a bit he breaks around the same time as me i just decided to let him go in front too aggressive and he ends up spinning and taking me out with him and the shitty part about that really it just pissed me off a lot is that he didn't slow down he didn't have any sort of that he didn't say anything on the radio he wasn't sorry whatsoever he didn't say in chat after the race really pissed me off here i don't know what was up with him but uh here in a second we'll get a first person view of the crash i couldn't do anything i locked up trying to avoid him and you can just see he gets back on the gas and just tries to sh rock it away, which I just find a very shitty thing. Comment below that. if you guys think that was shitty as well, because, guys, dude, that pissed me off a lot. Voice, man. I'm not even going to lie to you. And here I'm just talking about it. Now going through here, I'm trying to just dude, make the pace up. We had a bit of front wing damage shit like that the tires were worn Very out bad. like fucking hell <laughs> and just trying to do as well as we can from here making pace up trying to catch him if we are able to the blue guy in the back obviously gained a lot of time through that wreck if we didn't wreck we would have probably rocked away from the guy honestly i don't think he would have had the pace to have us too fighting cooper hard no, Sasha would have the crazy pace and me dropping off from I don't think we would have had to deal with him, but and I can tell you as we'll see for the next few laps, we have to deal with him quite a little bit. A very good driver. Now, here we go down the straight. All three of us very close together after the two laps. I'm just riding on Sasha's bumper to try and get that crazy draft off of him. I end up going on the inside doing a reverse master sap and just getting the place on them too. Both of them at the same time. It was very, very good driving for me. Here's another view, hopefully, in a few seconds here. Yep, here we go, another view, me just going on the inside, quickly just rocketing away from them, and just great driving from all three of us around, honestly. I, Sasha, he's quick, just not great with the etiquette and stuff, but good at avoiding things. And here we go. And here we are, going down the straight again, just fighting, me and Sasha just side by side right there. All three of us, the blue car getting a draft, me going in the middle, just getting that super late braking. Me and Sasha just going side by side once again. Insane driving. I end up going in the inside, getting a little bit of better drive through here. Trying to block the blue car from going through the middle here. I end up getting a little bit ahead. You can just see all three of us down the start finish straight. Just insane driving. Blue car lets up a lot. Yellow still going up ahead. Me, I'm in the middle here. We end up making a little bit of contact as the blue car just doesn't know how to stay on the inside. <laughs> um... Now, I'm a little bit back, but we're going to try and cut the draft going through Eurusian Radion up here. There we go. Turn one, and then the second turn. 
very scary, especially on worn tires with a little bit of aero damage in the front there. Going on the blue car just side by side through the whole thing, man, just just blocking me through the whole thing. I just go end up going through the middle, get a little bit of draft off of Sasha right there, and just boom, late braking through there, just insane driving from all three of us. And I end up making both positions right through there, just an aerial shot right here, just crazy, just right through the middle, boom, just right by them. Really, really fun doing that. Very, very scary though. Thought I would have gotten hit or something, but here we are going down the start the last straight again. Here is a big oh. incident in the race. Lap car up here, me and the blue I'm car fighting through my, here. I'm side by side with him again. I end up getting past right. him just like Max Verstappen did. It was a great move. Go Brown ahead. car up here. I tell him I'm going inside, go inside, go inside, and he doesn't. He end up cutting me off and I tap Dude, him. What the fuck are you doing, man? Get the and fuck out of the way. That happens. Cards. Very pissed off about that one still. Now Going through again, still just nothing I could do. He just didn't fucking move out of the way like an idiot. All three of us. There's nowhere I could have gone and just, yeah, we're screwed. Just tap him on the back here. All these views of it. It's a really shitty incident. Got me a lot of points for that one. But safety rating still is okay. We end up losing both positions that we fought super hard for down the straight. And now me trying to fight, get into the blue car's position. He ends up going through on the inside here, spins the car a little bit, going through a little bit slow, right on his ass, and I just tap him super, super bad and sent. Sort of my fault. Really, really apologetic. But as you can see, he just goes way too slow. He's just not on pace whatsoever, and I end up tapping him. Now, next lap, me and Sasha just fighting our way, trying to catch up to Sasha. Sadly, it just isn't happening today, I guess, but... You know, second place for that race, still, still a very good position, honestly, I gotta be happy with that. Me congratulating them and being happy with it, being happy with the result. Honestly, I had no hard feelings with anybody, but here we are. Sasha, I'm not gonna lie, the race win, dude, it's lucky. I'm surprised you didn't spin how aggressive you were, but props to you, dude. And same with Arginus, it was very fun racing both of you guys. Let's try and keep the aggressiveness down next time now. Almost all the huge breath. So yeah, guys. Um, if you enjoyed the video, go down below, like, subscribe, leave a comment below for all the things I've been talking to you about. If you guys made it to the end of the video and you're here still, go ahead and leave a comment below that says, uh, radical, just radical, and um, subscribe, turn on the bell for notifications, and yeah, have a wonderful day, night, wherever the fuck you.